So guys, it's been a minute since I've drawn a human being that wasn't, you know, a cartoony, abstract character. So I thought to myself, maybe I should get a reference from the internet. Maybe, maybe I should look at Pinterest or something. Maybe, maybe I should, I should find a really good reference. Something human-like, you know, something that like shows exactly what pose I'm trying to create. Maybe I could, maybe I could find one on the internet. Maybe, maybe I could find one on, you know, the internet. You know, the internet, that, that place people go to get references and models of poses that they want. Maybe, maybe I should get a pose from the internet. See the thing. You know, the worst part is they are literally called models. It's literally their profession their purpose Okay, I'm going to I'm 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 going to I'm going to go draw now. Okay. Bye. So, I'm on a new camera right now. I can see something on the lens and I don't want to touch it right now, but um I am getting ready for a job interview. Um the thing that makes this job interview so different from a normal one at least is that I'm going to a job interview where I know from the start I'm going to refuse the job. I got nervous when I was on the phone and the lady was talking and just you know, all the emotions and like oh yeah 945 works for me even though I don't want this job and I have a feeling when I get there, I'm gonna learn how much I don't want this job, and and I don't want to sound like I'm ungrateful for the opportunity, because I am. I'm grateful that somebody finally called me back, but um, I also know what the Lord told me, which is that I'm supposed to start my own business. So it didn't come as a surprise when I prayed and he said, no, this is not the job. <laughs> um, but it is 8.38 and I need to be there in like an hour. So I'm going to brush my teeth, do my makeup, breathe, say the name of Jesus because he is Prince of Peace. No joke, I typed his name and even a wave of peace came over me. And yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I have no idea what the back of my head looks like, so let's check that too. <laughs> um because you know I will be walking away from people and it would be nice. To know, oh, that's not too bad. Yeah, uh, that's not too bad. Let me try to get a clearer lens here. Yeah, that's that's perfectly fine. I think that's perfectly reasonable. Like, I might put a bobby pin to keep it in place, but it looks fine. Oof. I'm overdue to wash my hair. Um, I will not tell you by how much. Just know that it's bad. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and change into my outfit um, that I raided my mom's closet for because I've been working. Oh. Like I said, I've been working in casual environments that didn't really require me to dress up. And even in the most casual one, I was the most dressy, but even then, like I don't have any trousers and I don't have, I just have blouses. So I had to raid my mom's closet, borrowed a pencil skirt and a blouse from her, 
Uh, she used to work in offices all the time, so she has a whole bunch of uh, business professional outfits. Um, I don't know. It's just... Just proof that I need to make money so I can go get the closet that I wish I had. Because I legit felt like the rich best friend in the gay drama. I'm just saying. <laughs> but I will catch you guys after the interview and after I talk to a friend. So, bye-bye. She cleans up nice. Hello. So, I finished my interview. Um, it went okay. I did perfectly. I just already knew going in that I was not going to accept the job. And then after the interview, I was more convinced that God was right, as he always is. And it wasn't for me. I have a problem when I get on the phone with the recruiter and they can't tell me what the job is. Oh, you'll find out at the interview. And then I get to the interview and, oh, we can't tell you what it is just yet. We're waiting until round two. Why am I wasting my time if I don't even know what I'm doing? No, something doesn't seem right, so we're gonna leave. Um, and again, all the glory to God because while I was in that situation, I just felt him reminding me, no, it's a no. No matter what they say, it's a no. So. <laughs> that leads into the next thing, which is... <laughs> uh, I got home. I looked for something to eat. Still haven't eaten. Need to do that. Got on my phone. Lovely Instagram. And this woman's on here talking about why she has her Costco membership. I don't talk about it often, but I I have a bit of a beef with Costco. It's irrational. I know it's irrational. <laughs> it's um it's over something that is not really a big issue, but it, it was big enough to me that it hurt my feelings. So why is this woman convincing me I need a Costco membership, though? She says there's this thing called Costco Next, and that it gives you discounts on Korean skincare. Hi, friend. <laughs> yeah, we're, Costco and I are probably going to become friends now because of this one woman on Instagram. <laughs> well I guess the feud's over <laughs> as long as it works but that's basically how today has been going got some good tea and I passed on an opportunity that wasn't really serving me um, other than that this outfit I do not feel like I got dressed up for nothing I did get dressed up because I love being dressed up. However, when I got into the car, and you can't really see it the way that the camera is, or maybe you can, I can't really see the, the screen, but like, got into the car with my coat on the first time, and I'm all covered up, and I'm all nice and pretty and happy, and everything's great. Get in the car with my coat open. So much thigh. <laughs> This slit is in such an awkward place because if it hikes up, it's so much thigh. <laughs> and I'm not trying to do that. So like right now, this is tasteful. This is like, this is like short level, like shorts, a good pair of shorts. This is like good. Why in the car was I like a hooshie mama? <laughs> Oh my gosh, so much, so much, so many thoughts. Um, but yeah, that's post interview update and just thoughts, so many thoughts. And I still need to put 
just I haven't had breakfast at all and I went through all those butterflies and I intentionally didn't have breakfast so I wouldn't be sick um only to come to find out like I was nervous up into the point of the actual interview and in the actual interview cool calm collected thoughts all put together I'm processing what you're telling me and I'm spitting it back out to you how you need to hear it I don't know what it is I don't know but it's what it is call it a gift I don't know but I need to eat clearly because I'm not focusing <laughs> I need sugar <laughs> I need a dopamine hit. <laughs> so I will talk to you guys shortly. So see you then.